one day, when he'd gone into the house to have his dinner, he left behind a heap of potatoes that he'd been digging and a sack hanging on the wall. And there were the flower pots, two little ones, two middle-sized ones, and two great big ones. And just behind the big flower pots was a little weed. And there they all were, lying quietly in the warm sunshine. The little weed looked all about her, and when she saw that everything was quiet, she was just going to knock gently on the big flower pots as usual, when the two little flower pot men popped up, both together, and they said, Hello, little weed, we're up. And before the little weed had time to say a word, they both popped down again and called out, now we're down. Now we're top. Now we're top. They went on like this for quite a long time. Oop. Dop. Oop. Dop. Oop. Dop. Until the little weed called out, stop, stop. Weed. 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 So then they jumped out. Oop. And went over to the sack and sat down because they were quite out of breath. After a minute, one of them got rather tired of resting, and he thought what fun it would be to play a trick on the other and go away and hide. <laughs> so he got up and crept quietly away and went and hid behind the sack that was hanging on the wall. Then the other one got tired of sitting still too, and he thought what fun it would be to play a trick on the other one and go away and hide. <laughs> so he got up very quietly and turned round, and he saw the sack hanging on the wall. But he didn't go behind it. He climbed up and got inside. <laughs> <laughs> and there they both were, each hiding from the other. They waited for a moment, but nobody came to find them, so they began to call out. Cooey! 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 <laughs> when they found out they'd been hiding from each other, they laughed and laughed and laughed. <laughs> I want huddle from you. <laughs> I want huddle from you. <laughs> then the one who'd been hiding behind the sack wanted to get in it. Ah, oh, what get it? Oh, 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 oh. They went right down to the bottom of the sack because it was nice and warm down there and began to play about. <laughs> but the sack didn't want to have two little flower pot men playing about inside it, so it lifted itself up and shot them both out. And there they were, crawling on the ground. They picked themselves up and looked round, and when they saw the potatoes, they thought it would be a good idea to play with them. Oh, lop, plop, water, plop, hot, hop. Hmm, lop. Now they knew that some potatoes have eyes, so they thought they'd look to see if they could find one. No. Oh, heedle, wop, eep, glop, oip. Oh, a heedle, model. A heedle, model. Oh, hello, hello. Then one of them found a potato with a nose. Oh, he pulled up a knot. Knot, oh, what a knot. <laughs> then they found a very funny potato. He had eyes and a nose and a mouth. Oh, he pulled up a knot, a boot. Ooh. Oh, 
<laughs> and one called out, let's pull him out. Oh, let's pull up. Oh, pull up. But before they could get their hands on him, the potato raised itself a little and said in a rather proud potatoy voice, there is no need to pull me out, thank you. I can get out myself, if I want to. But I'm quite comfortable where I am. And he sank down again among the other potatoes. Oh, wattle bubble. Oh, wattle bubble. The flower pot men were very pleased to find a potato that could talk. And they said, whoever would think an ordinary potato could talk? Odd, oddly plot. Then the potato raised itself again and said in his rather proud potatoy sort of voice, I am no ordinary potato. I am a potato man. And before the flower pot men could say any more, he began to walk about. Oh, bottle, bottle, diddle. And he went on walking about very proudly before them. Then he said, You may look at me if you like. I'll stand quite still. There he was, with a fine big potato for a head, two eyes and a nose and a mouth, and a bigger potato for his body. And his arms and legs were made of potatoes. He turned from side to side. Then he said, Am I not the most beautiful potato man you ever saw? Oh, yeah. <laughs> and the potato man said, Perhaps you'd like to know who I am. I am Dan the Potato Man. Find a better if you can. You will never, never see another potato like me. Little Bill and Little Ben, you are only flower pot men, but I am Dan the Potato Man. When he'd finished dancing, one of the flower pot men said, Are you the only potato man? I am the only one in this heap of potatoes. There is, of course, a potato man to every potato heap. He is, in fact, the king, and no other potato can move except the king. That gave the other flower pot man an idea, because he was tired of hearing the potato man say how wonderful he was. And he muttered, he's not the only clever potato. Uh, he's not a lot of clever plot shot up. No. Uh. Then he got up and crept away. The potato man went on talking. Where has your friend gone? Oh, top, top. You don't know, but you should know. Oh, top, top. Oh. And just at that moment, the other flower pot man came back with a little potato bobbing along behind him. He called to it and whistled, just as if it were a little dog. Oh, no. And the potato man stared and stared and stared. Now, all this time, the little weed had been watching. She knew which of the flower pot men had gone out and found the little potato. Now, listen because the little weed is going to ask a question. Was it Bill or was it Ben? 
Fetched that small potato then Which all fools do flour but men Was it Bill or was it Ben? Was it Bill or was it Ben? It was Bill, it was Bill. Do you know what he'd done? It wasn't a potato that could run about at all. It was just an ordinary little potato which he'd tied to his heel with a bit of cotton that the potato man couldn't see. Oh, no. <laughs> but the potato man didn't know that, and he was not quite so proud when he lay down again because he thought there might be other potatoes as good as he was. Then Ben said to Bill, Quick, you put the little potato away, because if he finds out that it wasn't really walking, he'll be as proud as ever. <laughs> then the other one tried to remember the potato man's song, and he began to jig about. While they were sitting there, they heard the little weed calling. She was telling them that the man who does the garden had finished his dinner, and she heard him coming down the garden path. So they jumped into their flower pots again. Then they said goodbye to each other. Then they said goodbye to the little weed. The little weed stayed behind the flower pots and went fast asleep. And there they all were in the warm sunshine. But the man who worked in the garden didn't know that anything had happened at all. Nobody knew about the flower pot men. Only you saw them playing. And the little weed. And I think the little house knew something about it. Don't you? Goodbye, Bill. Goodbye, Ben. Bill and Ben, Bill and Ben, flower pot men. Goodbye, Bill. Goodbye, Ben. Bill and Ben.